Perhaps no one can describe Jonathan Van Ness better. Yes, yes, yes than Jonathan Van Ness. It wasn't really an option for me to be closeted or to keep it to myself. Sky's blue, grass is green, can't fight it. By his own account, he's an effervescent, gregarious, cotton candy, figure skating queen. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> look at you. Hello. But Queer Eye's hair and grooming guru says there are many other sides to him, all candidly covered in his new book, Over the Top, which comes out Tuesday. In the memoir, Van Ness reveals that seven years ago, at the age of 25, he tested positive for HIV after fainting while working in a salon. He writes, that day was just as devastating as you would think it would be. In an interview with the New York Times, Van Ness says the journey is still hard. I've had nightmares every night for the past three months because I'm scared to be this vulnerable with people. But his revelation has been met with overwhelming support. Adam Rapon writes, a hero from Patricia Arquette. Thank you for shining a light. Plus love from his Queer Eye co-stars. I'm so proud of the strength to share his story. I think it's a really important story to be shared. In response, Van Ness took to Instagram to say thanks, not only to the people who I have known, but everyone else who has showered me with grace. It truly means the world. About 1.1 million people in the U.S. are living with HIV. According to the CDC, more than 38,000 were diagnosed in 2017, with the number of new diagnoses each year remaining largely stable since 2012. You are amazing just the way you are. Van Ness is also using his memoir to discuss his struggles with self-esteem, drug abuse, and being sexually abused as a child. He writes, Sometimes I think people only want to see the side of me that's power-stopping in stilettos or spinning around on figure skates. But this book is my chance to show you more. It's not going to be pretty, but it's my truth. And if I don't share it, I won't be able to help others.